Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, welcome. My name is Patty. I do fashion and beauty videos. Now today's video, I'm going to be sharing three ways to style a pleated skirt. And as always, don't forget to pass by my blog, pattiescloset.com, and also follow me on Instagram at patties underscore closet, and there you'll see more fashion and more beauty content. All right, guys, I am continuing this series on this channel, which is three ways to style. Um, you guys seem to love it a lot when I did the first one, which was three ways how to style a fox mini skirt. And I'm so glad you guys like that because I'm a big um, believer in maximizing your wardrobe and i'm also a big fan of just like repeating clothes and just styling them in a different way i feel like that kind of just peeks into my like style creativity like how many ways can you just style um the same item over and over i think that is so fun and it's also such a great way to maximize your wardrobe and for today's video, I'm going to be doing that with a pleated skirt. Now, pleated skirts are going to be a big trend in 2020. I'm so happy that they're back because I absolutely love pleated skirts. I feel like they're so chic and you can kind of wear them with like almost everything. Um, I've tried them with boots. I've tried them with sneakers. I've tried them with pretty much everything. And I feel like they just match with just anything. Are you guys excited that pleated skirts are back in trend for this year? I definitely know that I am. All right, guys, so let's go ahead and get started. Here's three ways how to style a pleated skirt. All right, guys, so here goes outfit number one. So the pleated skirt that I'm styling um, in this video. Now, this skirt, I got it at Forever 21. It was fairly inexpensive. I feel like you can find pleated skirts um, almost anywhere. They come in so many materials, different um, colors, uh, just a different style. And this one that I got, it's kind of a little bit of like a metallic-y kind of uh, finish on the skirt. So for this first look here, I paired it with a sweater. Now this sweater has like a nice opening up on the top. And just so I don't look like I was drowning with the pleated skirt since it's kind of like wide and just has like a lot of movement, I tucked the sweater in just to kind of give it more of like a fit look. Now this skirt is kind of like black, but it has a little bit, maybe because of like that shiny um, finish that it has, it kind of gives off a little bit of like a cream color. So the color of the skirt with the sweater just kind of matched perfectly and it almost looked like a nice kind of fall or maybe even like a spring outfit you can say. I finished off a look with some accessories. Um, I went ahead and I paired some ankle booties. Now these ankle booties are kind of like cream. They have a little bit of uh, buckles around it. And it just kind of made the look more comfortable, kind of like a casual, chic type of vibe. And then I added a kind of like a light mint shoulder bag. And then I also added some frames. Now these frames are not prescribed. They're just kind of like a nice little touch to an outfit. Now this is one way to style this pleated skirt. Very comfortable, very casual. And that's what I call my kind of outfit. Alright guys, for look number two, I kind of dressed it up a little bit. Um, I went ahead and I paired it with these ankle booties that are just so amazing. They are metallic and I absolutely love these boots. Anytime I wear these boots, I feel like I get stopped in the street and just kind of ask where did I get them or just like where are they from. I absolutely love these booties. They kind of make the skirt just stand out even more. Now for the top of this outfit, I kind of leveled it out and I would say that this outfit is very much my style, kind of like dressed up. But still has that kind of like in between chic vibe so I paired it with a graphic tee which is so me I absolutely love graphic tees and I love dressing them up just like I did with this pleated skirt now this top says mascara and coffee because life is all about mascara and coffee duh and then I also went ahead and I added a moto jacket to it so you see how it's kind of like dressed up but just kind of not I feel like this outfit is definitely my style I love moto jackets graphic tees and but I also love to dress up and just kind of mix that together I would say that this outfit definitely describes my style and again to accessorize some sunglasses and just a black plain shoulder bag 
I absolutely love how different this look looks from the first one just by kind of switching out the sweater and switching out the shoes. These shoes make such a big difference um, to this outfit. And that's part of the things that I love about kind of styling the same piece in different ways and just styling it over and over. Just kind of adding pieces, um, switching up pieces, just to kind of see the outfit just absolutely trans. Alright guys, now we're on to the last look here. Now with this pleated skirt, this is what I called glam. I went ahead and I dressed it um, up by adding some ankle strap stilettos. I absolutely love these pumps. They just dressed up the look. I paired it also with a gray turtleneck. And just to give it more of that glam vibe, I added a statement necklace. I didn't want to add any color uh, to this look. I just wanted to keep it more very like black and grayish and very glam that way. So even the necklace is kind of like the same color, the whole vibe of like black and um, gray. But definitely adding the necklace, it definitely dressed up the look and that's exactly what I was going for. I wanted something dressed up, something glam. And then I also added a moto jacket, but this jacket kind of comes with like a fox fur um, neck stole that you can kind of take off and take on. I've worn this jacket without the stole and it looks absolutely uh, different. But since I was going for like that dressed up glam vibe, I went ahead and I kept it and it just looked so kind of like a modern day Marilyn Monroe, I would say. I always say accessories make such a big difference to your outfit just by adding this necklace, the kind of uh, fox fur stole around the neck. It just made such a big difference and it took the look exactly where I wanted to, to just kind of give out that retro glam feel. And it took the look exactly where I wanted to, to just kind of give out that retro glam feel. There you have it. That's three ways to style a pleated skirt. Like I said, pleated skirts are going to be so big of a trend this year in 2020. I'm very excited for that. Comment down below and let me know which look is your favorite. And actually, do you guys love that trend, the pleated skirt trend? I'm so excited to continue this series, Three Ways How to Style. I hope that these little uh, tips kind of help you guys out on how to kind of maximize your wardrobe and not just wear one item and just throw it in the back of the closet, just kind of like pop into your creativity in your head and just kind of see how you can style uh, the same item uh, differently over and over in your closet. If you guys have any specific requests on how to style a certain item multiple ways, I'll be happy to do that for you. Just if you guys enjoyed this video, please give it a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel. That link is down below. There's a new video here on Sundays, on Tuesdays, and on Thursdays. And that is it, guys. I will see you guys in my next video.